Happy beautiful day everybody. This is Jen with the Best Life Creation Society here to just give you a quick peek of a few of the things that happened inside of Best Life today. Today has been an incredible day. We had two Facebook lives, of course our daily meditation with Espen, and another awesome segment uh, hosted by Tracy Koba titled Feeling and Finding You. Uh, where which features uh, the freedom release method in a group format. So I encourage you to check that out. Um, and it really ties into a few of the things we're talking about today. So, but in addition to that, we also had a couple of really fantastic classes as well. One all about relationships and the other one, um, a continuation of our getting out ahead of it class um, titled In the Flow with Segment Intending. So, but I'd love to share with you today a wonderful, um, some information from this book, this little book here called Getting Into the Vortex by Esther and Jerry Hex. And um, just a little greater understanding of who you are and how loved, valued, and appreciated you are for being you. So um, this first little excerpt here is really all about our breathing and how it connects us to who we really are. So take a listen to this. It says, many assume that the process of breathing is only about your physical nature, but that is not the case. The process of breathing is much more than an essential function of your physical body. Indeed, it is the flowing of spirit to you and through you. That is the reason that when the focusing of spirit through your physical body ceases, your breathing ceases also. Yeah, take that in. Really, really powerful. And it makes perfect sense, right? We, you know, we identify independent life as beginning with first breath and the cessation of physical life um, that return to non-physical energy upon last breath. So, um, and here's a continuation of that and really to understand the, our importance in this wonderful physical universe. So, uh, it says that which is your source or God is fully aware of you right now and feels unspeakable appreciation for who you are. Your life is supposed to feel good to you, and you are meant to feel happiness in your life, and you are meant to satisfy your dreams. The source within you is always fully aware of you, even though you may not be fully aware of source. Unless you are in the state of alignment with the love that source flows to you, it is as if it is not really there, when in fact, it is always there. It is not enough to be loved by another. You must be a vibrational match to that love in order to know the experience of being loved, right? Just uh, kind of like the previous video I did, um, you know, discussing what are you tuned to? Right? Uh, when you can really tune into that feeling of God or source, right? That feeling of pure love energy. Yeah. Now you can really also receive that as well. So to be in your natural state of love and appreciation does not require lovable objects for you to focus your attention toward, but only an absence of resistance, which is the only thing that can hinder or mute your natural state of love and appreciation and well-being. In the absence of resistant thought, your vibration returns to its natural state of power and clarity and love. In the absence of resistant thought, your true nature of resilience and replenishment and vitality returns. In the absence of resistant thought, your true nature of eagerness and joy and fun returns. 
It is not through struggle and effort and trying that resistance is released, but instead through distraction and releasing and relaxing, right? Um, and that's something if you choose to tune into Tracy's segment uh, with the Freedom Release Method, you'll feel that. Or to incorporate some of these other tools, right, that we talk about and will continue to talk about over the upcoming days. But even if you take just a deep, cleansing, deliberate breath, you can really feel that energy. So, um, yeah, and just this closing uh, last two sentences. Your life is supposed to feel good to you, and you are meant to satisfy your dreams. There is nothing more satisfying than the deliberate alignment with what you have dreamed. Yeah, yes, you are meant to feel good, and uh, know that it's possible. And if you're already feeling good, know that there's more to come. Know that all that has preceded you has served you well. And to just enjoy the beautiful and unfoldment of your life, your beautiful becoming. Thank you for being you. You are loved and appreciated. <laughs>